In this video, we are moving on to the next step in the Maker Made CNC build, which is making the temporary sled. This is probably one of the easiest and quickest steps within the build, since all the cuts are by hand and the sizes are mostly relative for this part. We start by cutting out a square that's 18 by 18 inches, as well as two rectangles for the brick holders at five and a half inches by one inch. For this sled, I'm just using some MDF that I have laying around, but you can use any spare wood you have laying around just make sure it's relatively thick to handle the weight of the router and the chains that are pulling on it. To get the right diameter, I measured out the center point on the square for the sled and took a piece of a cardboard that I stuck a screwdriver through one end and then I measured out half the diameter and stuck a pencil through at that point. This way I could pin the screwdriver to the center of the sled and just rotate the pencil around creating a perfect circle at one and a half inches diameter. I realized this was kind of pointless because at the end I ended up having a bit that could drill out a hole at one and a half inch diameter. So measuring this out wasn't as necessary, but it should be helpful if you don't have a larger drill bit laying around. Next, I attached all the L brackets and the bearings that ride on the ring with the provided hardware. This next step is probably the most important for the temporary sled as it is also with the final sled. We need to mount the ring to the temporary sled and try to make it as centered around the hole we cut out as possible. You can see that I take several repeated measurements between each bracket and the hole before mounting it in. We are then going to attach the brackets to hold the bricks on the bottom right corners of this temporary sled. The exact position of these bricks isn't as important, more so to ensure that they're as close as merit as possible. We are also going to screw a hole into the top of the sled which is a great new addition in the design of the Maker Made CNC that wasn't in the original Maslow because it lets us hang the sled to a bolt in the top bar of the frame while we get to adjust a change on the sled and add or remove any of the plywood sheets. It's definitely one of my favorite new additions to the design. For the bolts that go through the bottom face of the sled, I made sure to countersink them so that the ends wouldn't protrude and the sled would sit flat against the plywood sheets. And then we are all done making the final sled. In the next video, I'm going to go over all the cable connections and calibrating for the machine, so make sure you subscribe and follow along the Maker Made build. Thanks as always for watching guys.